guys, the Chase Dog here, and welcome back to another unboxing on the channel. That's right, guys. Today we're going to be doing another NRL 2019 Traders unboxing. That's right, guys. And guys, this is going to be episode number eight. That's right, guys. So episode number eight. Previous episode will be linked in the description down below. And guys, if you haven't already, go and check out the playlist of all of the unboxings for the NRL 2019 Traders. You can check them out guys if you do enjoy watching all the unboxings and everything else on the channel make sure you hit that like button hard but not too hard because you break your computers guys don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell to join the dog squad and if you want to follow me on any social medias they're all linked in the description down below but like i said episode number eight of the nrl 2019 traders and we are doing seven booster packs right up in your face that's right guys seven packs right here right now it is awesome. So guys, we also will be going through what cards we still need to keep a, I guess you could say, an eye out for those cards. So I'm going to quickly go through that list, guys, before we start the episode, just so you know what to keep an eye out for. Also, if you haven't already, let me know out of these guys that we still need to get, which one you reckon will be the one that eludes us for the longest. Meaning, which one do you think will be the last one with the 2018 traders it was George Burgess so who do you think that last person is going to be from this list so we have the Broncos we have Azeku we have Milford and Nicarima from the from the Raiders we have Lelua the Bulldogs we have the Checklist and Martin from the Sharks we have Moylan and Pryor we finished the Titans finished the Seagulls from the Storms we have the Checklist Kenny Bromwich and Munster from the Knights we have SASA and Watson from the Cowboys, we are complete. Eels complete. Panthers complete. Rabbitohs complete. Dragons, we need DeBellin and Graham. Roosters, we need Cordner. Warriors, we need Beal. And Tigers are complete. So, out of all of those characters, well, not characters, but all of those players, guys, let me know in the comment section down below which you reckon will be the last one that'll lose us, like George Burgess has in the previous one. And I think it was Luke Bird. Uh, and I think it was Luke Brooks in the one before. So, like I said guys, seven packs to do in this episode, episode number eight. So without further ado guys, let's dive right into it. Here we go. So we're going to start like we always do, showing the inserts and just going quickly over which ones I have gotten before and which ones I have not. So, Platinum Parallels, we've got plenty of those. Face of the Game, yes. Season to Remember, yes. Club Heroes, yes. Star Tunes, yes. State of Origin Stars, yes. Last Line of Defense, yes. Uh, the SAS ones, which is the authentic NRL ones, we haven't got any of the signatures or the um, Emerald ones, but we do have one Ruby from the book. Uh, retirements, no. 4 and 2, no. Premiership Predictor, yes, from the first episode. If you haven't checked it out, guys, go and check it out. It was a fire episode. And of course, Legend Signatures, no. I would like to pull another Premiership Predictor. I have yet to pull more than one Premiership Predictor from each year, guys. I've only been pulling one from each year, so I'd like to pull a second one in this, hopefully this episode, guys. So let's hope that we can get another Premiership Predictor, as well as the cards that we need in the basic, guys. So cross your fingers, cross your toes, and don't forget to cross your nose, because we want that Premiership Predictor, or even a signed card, or even a Legends, was it, was it a signature? Yes, Legend Signature. So, without further ado, seven packs. Got my sleeves on the side ready to go if we do have any rares hitting our way. Oh, God. Oh, it's one of those packs that just refuses to open. Don't you hate those ones, guys? Let me know in the comments down below if you do. So, we are starting with the Eels, which we've already finished, like I said. We have Matt Scott, which I think we've finished Cowboys. Any that I miss, guys, if I miss any of the cards that um, I need, I will check after the video is done, just to double check. Uh, but feel free to let me know in the comment section down below just so I triple check because my dog squad let me know guys So we up Damien Cook and our rare is going to be Okay, so we haven't I don't think we have this guy uh, Faux Tuakia? Uh, uh, who knows I just butchered his name <laughs> From the Titans face of the game So we haven't gotten this one before because I would remember that one So that is cool to have that rare and of course we need him from the Raiders, so he's hoping we can get him eventually, but that is our Pearl. Well, not Pearl. I always call it Pearl because I'm so used to Pearl from like, I think it was last year's Traders or it was last year's um, Extreme Cards. It always gets in my head. I don't know why, it just does. So, going with Cameron Smith, uh, so, uh, yeah, Soliola, Taylor, 
And one thing I want to point out that I don't like with the Sea Eagle cards. The names are so dark. Like, why can't the names be written in white? So that it stands out a little bit more. Like, for example, like, that stands out a lot. That doesn't. Behind the camera, it's also kind of, like, hard to see it sometimes. So, thank God the Seagulls are done, so we don't need to really worry about them as much. So, moving on to our second pack, guys. Like I said, let me know as well in the comment section down below. Have you completed your set for the 2019 base set cards, guys? If you have, feel free to let me know. I'm curious to know how many of my Dog Squad members out there have finished their set. Okay, so with it, Damien Cook, Adam Blair. I don't think I need him. No, I need Bill. This is for a second there. Uh, Latrell Mitchell, I think I said I finished Roosters. So towards these last couple episodes, well, these next couple episodes, guys, it's going to be a little bit more slow when we are trying to figure out the cards until we get to the ones that we know that we need that one person or a couple of people. Oh, okay, I wasn't expecting that. Game one victory. I thought for a second that we had one more card before the rare. But the New South Wales Blues State of Origin star card. Game one victory. I think they won, was it, they, did they win all three guys? Let me know in the comment section down below. Did New South Wales win every single game last year? I can't even remember to be honest. 22 to 12 in Melbourne. I'm pretty sure it was one apiece and then New South Wales won in the final. I'm pretty sure New South Wales won last year. Let me know guys in the comment section down below, but that's a pretty cool card to get. And we've got Thompson as our pearl. Okay, Taylor. Thompson again, Fafita and Scott. Okay, so I'm trying to keep an eye out for the ones that I know that I need. Um, it is a little bit harder when you still have a huge list. Well, not a huge list, but you still have a bunch of people on the list to go. And I also have to kind of keep an eye on the piece of paper as well just to make sure. Because I don't remember everyone off by heart. Um, so James Maloney, Will Smith, Roosters Checklist. No, I need only need coordinate from there. Hess and our rare is going to be... Okay, it's going to be just a parallel card of Will Smith because you get those packs every now and then where they won't give you anything besides a parallel. So, Adam Woods, uh, no, Aaron Woods, not Adam Woods. Thinking of Adam Blair for a second. Rapana, Semi, Barnett. No, I don't need you. And Elliot. Okay, so still nothing new to the base set, guys, which kind of sucks because I'm kind of hoping, you know, we can get some of these ones and then we can get down to like the last, like maybe one or two characters or, or players, I mean and um, just like hunt those guys down. Like we can just dedicate our time to looking for those ones as well as the rares. But I guess it just means that more episodes come to you all on the YouTubes. So we have Cohen Hess, Alex Thole, Rambo, uh, Regan Campbell Gillard, Greg Inglis, and our rare is going to be finally, we haven't had a star tune in a long time. I'm pretty sure, yeah, star tunes on the back, yeah. I know, I'm pretty sure we have had a normal star tune before, but we got Jake Travojevic. I haven't had one of these in so bloody long, guys. Jake Travojevic from the Seagulls, a star tune card. Very nice. The lock, indeed. Number seven out of 18 of the star tunes. But that's pretty cool, guys. I haven't had one of them in a while, so it's actually good to get one and, you know, getting that New South Wales card as well. So there's Smith. But getting that New South Wales one as well, some cards that we don't have, rare-wise, is always good to get. So, um, also with this episode and the next episode, they're not like mixed ones, they're all from the same news agency. I just bought like tons of packs from the same news agency just because it was getting to like, I do like going around and mixing it up a bit, but I thought like I didn't have time at the, you know, because of work and stuff. So I just bought a bunch from the same news agency. But next time, maybe we will mix it up a bit more. So Semi, Barnett, Elliot again, and a Broncos checklist. So still nothing to the collection, but we're getting some good rares. Three more packs to go from this seven pack video unboxing guys. Like I said, let me know in the comments down below if how much you're enjoying this. Let me know also if you're enjoying all the other stuff on the channel, whether it's the other unboxings we're currently doing, uh, whether it's, of course, like, you know, because we're doing Pokemon again on the channel. Uh, we're going to be doing some Yu-Gi-Oh. I don't know if I've uploaded any Yu-Gi-Oh since I've recorded some, but at this time, I'm not sure if I've uploaded or not. Um, we've got some other stuff that, you know, I don't know. I don't want to say it just in case I haven't uploaded it yet. Uh, but some secret stuff coming to the channel, which is going to be cool for unboxing. Some vintage NRL stuff, we might be doing some more of that on the channel soon. And some soccer, AFL, just tons of stuff, guys. So, Lawrence, Cody Walker, James Maloney, Will Smith. And now, Rare is not going to be there, so checklist of the Roosters. Ooh, we haven't had one of these in a while. We got ourselves one of the harder to get. Checklist, uh, what was it, Platinum Parallel? 
checklist platinum parallel of the Warriors. We have an Eels one, so these are the ones I will be collecting because these are a lot harder to get. The um, the checklists, so I'm gonna put that in the rare pile, and of course we got English as our normal parallel. But those ones are a lot harder to get because you don't get them much, and when you get them, they always come before that, so they're in the space of a rare. So that's always cool. Uh, we got Kahu. We got a seagulls, which I'm not even going to worry about anymore because hard to read some of their names because it's so dark. Uh, Woods and Rapana. So still nothing new to the base set. Like I said, I might have went over something, guys. If I have, let me know in the comment section down below. I will double check anyway after this video is done. But if it's always good just to have, you know, my dog squad let me know. Hey, you missed something. Maybe you need to triple check. Oh, this one doesn't want to. Okay, so this one's refusing to be open the, the classic way classic Jace dog way but we'll just open it that way okay so maybe there's something in here if it didn't maybe if it's refusing to open my normal way maybe it's like hey don't open me you got something rear on me mate okay so McKins Thompson Kiri oh, I don't I did need Kiri before but I think yeah we no I didn't need him but oh well. Kiri Reynolds and nothing so by the looks of it nothing in this one so Brown and we got Hudson and then of course we got that dude, Funa Blake, Hodgson, and Townsend. So still nothing, and we're down to the last pack, but we've gotten a bunch of cool new rares. Nothing really standing out besides, of course, the Star Chain that we haven't gotten before. We haven't had one of this in a long time anyway, so I'm happy with that. Uh, checklist, um, and then I think it was the New South Wales card, which is pretty cool. So Tohu Harris, Tamaro, Merrin, Masters and the rare, please something good. Ooh, okay, so we haven't had a last line of defense in a while either. So that's pretty cool. Jake Friend as our last line of defense card. Very nice. I haven't had one of these in a while. There's the back if you want to read it, guys. Give it a good pause so you can have a little read. But we have Jake Friend as the last line of defense. That's my second ever, I believe. So that's pretty cool. Uh, Jake Travoyevich as our parallel. There we go, <laughs> we finally get one on the last pack, one that we need, Kenneth Bromwich, so that's awesome, put him up the top, uh, Croker, I don't need you, Gallon, I don't need you, and Mitchell Pierce, I don't need you, so we got one card, one card from the ones that we need guys, unless I didn't miss a couple, who knows, I'll check after this video, but that is awesome, to get one and finally in the very last thing, so we're making some progress, with that one card, we made a tiny little bit of progress. <laughs> So, we have Jake Trevojevic, Hodginson, Inglis, Smith, Smith, Thompson, and Joseph Lelua as our parallel cards. That's pretty cool. We made some more progress in our collection by getting Kenneth Bronich. Yes, Kenneth Bronich from the Storm, so that's pretty cool. Finally, a little bit more progress in our collection, as well as some more rares that we don't have. So, of course, we haven't had a last line of defense in a while, so that's pretty cool to get a Jake Friend one from the Roosters. We haven't had one of these since the Eels one, so that's awesome as well. So we got a, another checklist of the Platinum Parallels, and this time it's Warriors. We got a Star Toon Jake Trevojevic card. We got a New South Wales Game 1 Victory card. And, of course, this dude from the Titans Face of the Game. That's, like, probably the first time I've had maybe only one Face of the Game in a long time, guys. So in my one, in my opinion, these two cards stand out to me the most. The New South Wales and the Jake Friend last line of defense guys. Of course, special shout out to the Warriors checklist platinum parallel, but these two stand out in my opinion the most. So guys, if you did enjoy episode number eight of the NRL 2019 Traders, make sure you hit that like button hard, but not too hard because you break your computers. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell to join the dog squad. If you want to follow me on any social medias, there are a link in the description down below. And guys, like I said, stay tuned because we have plenty more to go because we've only gotten, like, what, one out of that list that I told you at the start of this episode. So we still got a little bit more to go before we can even get very close to finishing this series. And then, of course, after we have finished the base set, I have a little side special series coming to the channel involving the NRL 2019 traders. So stay tuned for that, guys. Hopefully we can get to that soon rather than later. Sooner, well, sooner rather than later. But we'll soon find out when we get there. So like I said, guys, if you did enjoy this one, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and as always, stay awesome. The J-Stog is out of here. See you.